All right, so uh, we're doing a take on ceviche. The chef is doing a pretty classic. Cocktail de Camarón. Cocktail de Camarón. And uh, I'm just taking all the elements of the ceviche and just doing my own thing. So we're gonna start with butchering this guy right here. It's a nice piece of sea bream. I cheated a little bit, so all I'll be <laughs> doing is uh, cutting some veg here. Ceviche, I think depending on what country, has slightly different iterations. I think what makes like the, the foundation of a ceviche is lime cured fish. Right now the process basically with salt on the fish, just to kind of tighten up the skin. The Brazilians like to use our parm a lot. Nice little meaty ingredient, go with the fish right there. I think the magic in ceviche for me is, every time I have it, it's like the balance between the acid and the salt. So the base of this recipe is the clamato juice and the ketchup. As far as citrus is concerned, the acidity in citrus, the way it reacts with foods is just kind of cooks it. There's some science behind it, but like, I'm, a, I'm only a chef, <laughs> so. <laughs> this is a uh, cooking magic happening right now, guys. Look at that. So I'm also adding some other kinds of citrus. Nothing too secretive, guys. I'm just gonna dice up my fish. I'm almost ready to plate chef. This is where all the, the magic happens. A uh, key to this dish is like, if this tastes good, all gravy after that. Uh, I'm liking what I'm tasting, so this has now become my base. And I'm gonna just put everything together at this point, and then I'll adjust the seasoning at the end. The name of the dish is cocktail de camarón. So this is like, uh, it, it is like swimming in sauce. Sauce is like just as important as the, the seafood is. Give it some heat. And you know what? It needs more cilantro. <laughs> Always. All right, so we have our fish right here. Just gonna toss it up in the bowl. Our lime and grapefruit mix from earlier. A little bit of zest and the diced jalapeno, shallots, and serrano peppers. Now we throw it all in a bowl. Pistachio praline from earlier, just a little bit on there because I just want just a little bites of sweetness to come through. Have you ever seen that before or is this something that just, you know? It's just me just adding my own touch to it. Our Herbe de Provence chimichurri oil just as a finishing touch and we're good to go. All right, chef, so can I just uh, dig into that one? Please do, yes. Make sure you get all the seafood. That's balanced perfectly. And then just that creaminess from the avocado just brings it all together. That's that's really good. So I was a little suspect of the praline, <laughs> but I see how it works. I mean, my ceviche has some of the sweetness and you're incorporating uh, in a different way. Very delicious. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you, yeah.